working with multi-level calibration files to improve results from poorly resolved peaks. Please note that this video was produced using Chrome Perfect version 8.0.4. Some of the features and processes shown may be different in other versions of the product. In its simplest form, the calibration standard contains all the components of interest and only one injection is required as shown in this example. Frequently, multiple injections are made using the same or different amounts of the standard. This works well when all components are well resolved and a calibration curve can be plotted reliably. This chromatogram is a good example of when it is not practical to put all the components in the same standard solution. Here the peaks are poorly resolved, causing interference and lowering the reliability of the calibration curve. You can see the problem as we have two peak clusters with poor resolution between the peaks. The solution is to divide the components into two or more groups, making sure that in each mixture, no two peaks are poorly resolved. Starting with version 8, the sample data directory contains several files which illustrate this method and demonstrate the use of multiple levels in a calibration file to provide accurate results. The problem chromatogram contains five peaks. The first three are in a poorly resolved cluster, as are the last two. The calibration file defines five components. Each component's calibration curve has two data points, with amounts set to 1 and 2, respectively. The even-numbered components, numbers 2 and 4, are in one calibration standard mixture, and the odd-numbered components, numbers 1, 3, and 5, are in another. That makes four injections and four levels in the calibration file. It is important to note that for this to work, some of the levels of the calibration file are set to inactive, in green, or frozen, in red. This means that their values will not be updated during a calibration update. You can toggle these settings by double-right-clicking within the cells as demonstrated. Here is the file list. The cycle number matches the level 1 through 4, and number 0 is the one with all the peaks. The raw and bound files with cycle numbers 1 through 4 represent the four standard injections. The calibration file was updated with these files and then used to process the 0 raw file. If you open the five bound files in Analyze and overlay the chromatograms with Stagger, you will see the relationship at a glance.